Hey YouTube, Sign here, and today's video is going to be yet another comparison video. It's like I'm almost back to my normal now. Um, this comparison video is going to be looking at Boot Hill's best support characters, starting off with a solo battle comparison, comparing all six of the best Harmony units for him, Asta, Ron May, Sparkle, Branya, Robin, and Trailblazer Harmony. Now we're going to be looking at this um, on the creator experience server. So there still might be some little small minor changes before the official release, but I'm pretty sure at the time I upload this video, Boot Hill should be live and I doubt there'll be any real changes. But anyways, back to the actual comparison. So I decided to do a solo battle um, just to start off so people can see what the damage would be if you do each character individually. And then we're gonna follow it up with dual setups. So we have two setups. One will be Trailblazer Harmony setup. So each of the uh, the other five Harmony units will be paired with Trailblazer Harmony to see who gives the best result. And then the same thing will happen with Ron May. But um, this video kind of came up from a uh, request from a viewer. There was a comment on one of my previous videos asking about this, and I thought it's a good video. Now you might see here, I have a little damage breakdown. Um, after each portion of the video, um, when we complete a section, there will be a damage breakdown. So you can see each damage that is dealt by Boot Hill, and you can compare the damage between each of the Harmony units. Um, keep in mind, I did not factor in SP costs. If the setup is like SP negative, SP positive, I might consider that if people really care about it. I think that's a little bit too much information, but I know some people are like super nerdy about that. So let me know in the comments down below. I'm always looking to figure out things um, and try new stuff. Now you may have noticed that I, the section for that part is very short. Um, I didn't really have anything good to put in the background. Um, I thought about using art, but I didn't want to take anyone's um, art without permission. And I couldn't be bothered to ask anyone. I am considering maybe doing commissions for that. So we can have like art in the background. I'll just talk over the numbers rather than talk over the gameplay. Cause I can imagine that watching four screens at the same time can be kind of confusing to people. Um, I like to do it because you can see everything. You see my mistakes or my, my misplays, or if you feel something is wrong or the, like maybe I'm lying or something, I want to show evidence rather than just talk over it. Um, but I do think it'd be better that I talk over the actual numbers and give a little bit more context to it. Let me know how you guys feel about it, but, but I think I might just leave it on the still image with the numbers in the background. I'm still working on that. Now, when it comes to the second portion, we're looking at the Trailblazer Harmony setups and you can see that it's crazy, but Robin is just chunking this boss down. I don't know what, what steroids he's on, but Robin was just stealing the show here. I don't know what happened. Uh, I know it, it's her memory of chaos technically because she's the current rate up five star character, but man, she was working real good. <laughs> she was just outperforming every character by a mile shot, which I was surprised. I was really expecting Branya to be number one, but Robin stole the show. I think it's more because of this enemy he has the ability to protect his um, toughness bar and Robin being able to do advanced forward um, for the whole party at any moment you want when you activate her ultimate really gives her a huge advantage here. Now with Ron May, the same thing is gonna happen here. Robin is gonna really, she's gonna show off, man. It's crazy. Um, now you may notice I do have a non Ron May team is because I already used uh, Ron May with the Trailblazer in the previous section. So um, in this section, I decided to do a Asta Branya mix because I wanted to try a team without um, any of the other characters. And I thought Asta Branya may perform better than pretty much most of the other teams. And in fact, they did. Uh, I would argue that it performed better than any team with the Trailblazer in it, which is kind of unfortunate. Um, I think part of that is due to Asta being fire, which does help break the gorilla in the middle. Um, that advantage helps greatly because you can kind of break him with one combo using Boot Hill. This was kind of the same idea with Robin, kind of too, because Robin can 
hit the, the uh, monkey and help break. So that additional damage makes things a lot easier. You can see I'm kind of thinking about what to do with Asta set up. Um, Asta was much longer than every other part because I had to think about what would give me the most damage. So it took me a little bit of time just messing around with it. But when it comes to the damage portion of things, I, I'm honestly surprised by how good Robin did. Straight up, Robin was like, I didn't think she would do nearly as good. And beating out Branya consistently was really surprising because Branya, I have it tuned so that Boot Hill would attack before Branya. So he gets the double turn, getting up to, I believe, four attacks in a single cycle. If you didn't know, all these cycles are cycle zero. I have in the um, damage breakdown. But even the uh, four cycles, the four attacks in one cycle is not nearly enough when compared to like um, the three attacks with Robin. Also, part of it just comes to the fact that Robin just does a good damage with uh, your supports too. So that's something I don't really factor in. Like with Ron May, Fu Swen, and uh, attacking, their basic attacks do really good damage thanks to Robin. Now we do have the stat breakdown here. So if you have any questions, feel free to look at the stats. I'm gonna keep this video very short. I don't really wanna talk too much. Um, if you have any questions or anything you wanna talk more about, feel free to go down to the comments. Um, let me know what you guys wanna see in future videos. I'm pretty much gonna be uploading one more video for Boot Hill, which should be releasing um, in the next couple of days. So. Uh, that'll probably end my Boot Hill showcase, and I'll probably preparate, uh, start preparing for the newest five-star character, who should be Firefly. I would like to thank you guys for watching. If you enjoy this content, leave a comment down below. Leave a like, all that YouTube jazz. I will catch you in my next video. Until then, thanks for watching, and I'll see you then. Oh, one thing um, I forgot to mention. So when I run Trailblazer and... Um, Ron, my trailblazer and Ron made in the same team. One is running the signature light cone, which is trailblazer and Ron mage running the break, the four star break effect light cone. Okay. Thank you guys. I'll catch you guys in the next video later.